Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today, I'm doing this look for you guys. It initially was going to be a complimentary look with the orange in the inner crease and the blue liner, but then it ended up becoming a rainbow look because I added purple and I really like the extra depth it added to the look. If you guys wanna see how I got this look, please keep watching. All right, so first thing I did was I just took some decorative scissors and I used this design and I cut a piece of tape and I put that as I would a piece of tape for eyeliner because I want my eyeliner to have some sort of design to it. So yeah, that's what I did for that. I'm gonna take this matte eyeshadow called Kessie and I'm gonna apply that all over my eyelid. Now I'm gonna take the NYX eyeshadow in the color STFU and I'm gonna apply that to the inner part of my crease. I'm gonna be bringing that color all the way down to the inner corner and dragging it halfway through the crease. I'm gonna take the same blending brush and I'm gonna take this orange eyeshadow from the BH Cosmetics 120 palette and apply that right underneath that yellow. Now that shadow is not as pigmented as I'd like it to be, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this color from the Morphe 35O palette and apply that where that orange was being placed. Now I'm going to take a wider fluffy brush and I'm going to go back in with that yellow that I used and apply that right above the orange just to really intensify it again. Now I'm going to take a pointed brush and I'm going to apply this color from the Modern Renaissance palette right in the innerest inner corner and deepen up that orange. Now I'm going to take that same blending brush I used to apply the orange with no more product on it and I'm going to blend that color out a little bit. Now I'm going to take a little, little, little bit more product to help blend out this color. Now I'm going to take a smaller blending brush and I'm going to take this color, oh, this color right here from the Beach Cosmetics 120 palette and I'm going to apply that close to my upper lash line as my liner per se. Now I'm going to take this small dome brush and I'm going to take this green color and apply that even closer to the lash line. I'm gonna go back in with a smaller shader brush and reapply that blue because I see it's getting lost under the green but I wanna have it a little more concentrated but still a little smoked out. And since the green is a little light, I'm going to go ahead and apply this one right on top of it. Now I'm going to take a shader brush and I'm going to take the color IF from the Magic Palette and apply the farthest back right up against the tape. And finally, I'm going to take that same white eyeshadow I used to apply all over my lid. I'm just going to re-intensify that right between the two subjects. Now I'm going to take this color, mix with a little bit of this one, and use that to highlight my brow bone. I'm also going to take a little bit of Vermeer 
and use that to highlight my inner corner. Now I'm gonna take just the purple that I used and I'm gonna apply that to my little lash line. Now I'm gonna take some NYX Jumbo Pencil in Black Bean and I'm gonna apply that to my waterline. I'm gonna go ahead and set that with the same purple that I used on my lower lash line. Marcando, te voy marcando, 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 marcando,